Why, there's one now, sent in by Kim Varagas of Archbog. Icicle Lane is the title. I saw it as another bye-bye to winter. Sometimes the farewell can be a bit stronger, like this one from Sandra Wall in Falls. Consider it a so-long handshake. Some raindrops from Weston on Bald Mountain, another good sign of a fading season. And where does all that water go? Why, into streams, of course. Streams that become locations like Carley Brook Waterfall in Holmesdale, as Denny G. of Tafton points out. Another option? Well, how about this lake at Toby Hanna State Park by Serenity Rain? Toby Hanna. Nice open water here. So many possibilities, it's got everybody out here all abuzz. And Barwicky and Ashland caught a high-level meeting on the matter. The excitement over the possibilities of spring was too big for some to contain. Here's one example from Lisa Mickley Noxon. Others just went about the day's business. Deb S. and Waymart caught a fine example of that here. Clouds and shrubs, snow free from Carol Sizdek of Barnesville. Steve Morgan and Higgins sent us land in the mountain pretty much clear of snow. But aside from all that, we have color marking the beginning of spring. Leanne Davis of Orangeville sent this. From Bridget Lynn Bloomsburg, some of the brilliance marks spring along with the reminder that spring is a time of renewal to bloom, to embrace the beauty of new beginnings. On that note, we will leave you with a sunset at Laurel Lake from Dale White, Columbia Crossroads. Color something to surely be welcomed. Mike Stevens here in the PhotoLink Library.